Hi, ich bin Maria, ich komme aus Deutschland. Ich will gerne Ross Haar und ein bisschen Comicfigurenartigen Look. Okay. Will je een rondje draaien? Wil je iets doen voor you and the rest of the world? Wil je maar drehen, niet? <laughs> Oké, okay, dankjewel. Dank. Wat ben je de Blond haar altijd. Meestal blond haar. Heel wit. Heel is ze al lang afgestudeerd? Of? Voor mij is ze nog bezig. Zelfs. Hello friends on YouTube. Ik kan het doen voor haar. Als je wilt some of the length off. Bit on the shorts, I think, and um, kind of light up the color. Do that with a highlighter, and not with a bleach. Then I'm gonna color it, and she wants a nice, soft, outgrowing feeling for the fridge and the front. So, first, I open up her hair so I can see what I have. Still an old dread in it. <laughs> Can I keep it? The thread? Mm -hmm. Well, I think so. It's just one. There's just one thread in the back. Every time I'm surprised when somebody models for the first time. What <laughs> length is that you have to think about? I thought so, on the sleutel being of so, the rope. Ja, ja, dat is steeds lang. Iets langer. Ja, ik, ik ga gewoon de lijn pakken waar die het mooist is. Mm -hmm. On the bones at the front, so go to the back and then you see how lovely her waves are, her natural shapes. So when I cut on this line, I can cut with a hot scissor the rest and have a perfect line to work on. I have a wonderful condition of hair. The threads lay, lay on top. So I first make myself the first line by cutting the baseline. You can hear the condition of the hair is very nice and strong. This came off, I don't uh, donate it because it's uh, colored and bleached. Mm -hmm. Give it to her. <laughs> I will cut the hair with the TCC1 Carecut of Jaguar and with the hot razor of Ergo I do the front. First I start by wetting the hair. That is a bit so jammer. Pin the hair up, start the neckline. Zet het op de voor de chopsticks. 140 graden. 140? Ja. Ik put mijn scissor op 140 degrees Celsius. Make myself the first line. And this scissor seals the ends of the hair. And hold them closed for more than 4 months. So she can have whole summer without split ends. And a sexy feeling because it feels ultra soft hairs. Very feminine. Ik heb ook nog wel overwogen om mode te gaan doen. Ik heb ook naai cursus gedaan. Okay. Dus ik kan ook met naai machine werken en alles. Ik kan tekening lezen en uitzetten, betonen maken. Uh, dat is bizar wat je alles heeft gedaan. Ja, een beetje te veel hè. <laughs> Maar ik denk, ik vind dat zo leuk. Je kan zoveel verschillende ervaringen maken en uiteindelijk komen steeds weer dingen ook terug. Nee, die komen steeds weer terug. Ja. Mijn constructiebankwerker zijn ja. is nu weer terug omdat ik ambassadeur voor Kio in de schaar ben. Ja, en This line will be a blond line, so she will have a lot of hair afterwards because she has thick hair. Holding the dread aside, cutting the hair in a freehand style. This I can do because it lays in the natural shapes and I follow the natural guides because her waving was being seen in the hair. 
So you want to use these lines and always certain I have the best lines. This is the thread laying between it. Now I'm on the line that I'm on the top of her skull. So now I bent her head a little bit to the front. Then lay the hair back again. And then I can see the underlines when they whip out. So I'm making minor corrections to that. Not too much, it's just a little bit. But then I'm certain when she bends over her hair stays in, in one of the line. And this comes because the neckline doesn't pull as hard as the upper lines of the hair. Turn to the sides. Yeah, but it doesn't look like it's from a clear, so long as it's soft. No, but it's really soft. It's a 12-series series, so it's really soft. I like it. Absolutely. Connecting the front to the back. It is also in the natural lines. Onto the other side. Lay the thread aside again. Sorry, Bob. Oh, it doesn't matter. <laughs> you are not Bob Miley. <laughs> but then he shares you up. <laughs> and connect also this side <coughs> to the longer hair that I already cut. <coughs> I have something in my head. <laughs> As you want a small fringe, not too much, but also a soft one that flows nicely into the rest of her face. So I take a little bit of the front, go in with my hot knife, and go play into the sides. The nice thing of the hot knife is that it's 190 degrees Celsius. This is also theirs. It must look like an outgrown fringe. The hot knife is from Ergo, and Ergo is from the States. I write it also in the underlines. So now I have ultra fine line, not too hard, gently falling, all the power of the hair for the back. So, and the nice thing of doing it with a knife is when she lays it to the back, you don't see it because it's flowing into the other lines. When you would with the scissor, you always see the lines. Now you don't see it when you lay it back on there. So now I can make her a collar. Okay, I made a nook collar. And uh, I made it on uh, 12 0 and 12 1. She wants a little bit of outgrow, so that I also make. Not too much, just a little bit. I made this color with uh, 30 volume. Every time I lay a plastic between it, I'll show you that from the side so you can see a little bit more. Lay the plastic on the start of the hair.
and this color lights up for about uh, four or five shades. So in her case, it will be a nice, cool blonde color. Take every time about a centimeter. Make sure the foil lays like it has to lay. Then make sure there's enough color on the hair. Nu zou moeten sterven, dan roep ik wel heel erg dank je wel. Dan kan je wel zeggen, ik heb geleefd. Ja, absoluut. Mooi, dat is echt zo mooi. Now I applied all the color to her hair and on her hair. Leave out the outgrown so you can see. This is a leave on for uh, about uh, 25 30 minutes. And then I'll tell you afterwards till I find the shade of blonde enough. And then rinse it out and then I'll show you what I'm doing. Because we're going to color it with the shampoo on color based. After 30 minutes we rinse out the, hair, the color out of the hair. Now this we're gonna watch with a red shampoo because she wants uh, a soft pink color on it. This shampoo is of Lacme. The shampoo is also in violet, in gold, silver, brown and copper. This is just shampooing in and then leave it for a while so the color can get into the hair. Give that nice transparent shade to the hair. Now you see the color is already getting into the hair. And this uh, is about five minutes. So I think I can rinse it out and it leaves also a nice soft color behind in there. So why am I going to check on it? I'm going to check it out. Yeah, I'm going to check it out. So about the eating spoon and the eating spoon normal conditioner. Mix them together, apply it on the hair. A 
this makes their also very smooth. You see the condition of the hair? It's very fine. Those are smooth. So, I dry it with a towel and then I'm going to blow dry the hair. Okay, now I'm going to dry the hair. We'll do this with a large brush. Bit up the hairs. So, I can start in the neckline. Here you have to dread again. It's dreadful. No, it's, it's a bread. <laughs> I'm sorry for the bread. It's my baby. Eh? It's my baby. Yeah, it's my thing. <laughs> and thing was for the animals. <laughs> the Adam's family. Yeah, you know the Adam's family? Yeah. The kleine man should be good news. <laughs> okay, start blow drying with a large brush. The nice thing is when you cut the hair with a hot scissor or with a hot knife, you always have soft ends on the hair. They feel very soft, very gently, very feminine. And of course you can also use it on men. So far, blow drying. No, only have some hairs that stick out because I have that uh, dread in the hair. So there, I have to adjust it a little bit, not more than that. The following thing I put on the hair is uh, a polish of Lacme. I love this product because it's ultra nursing and brings out even more the colors. And smells ultra ultra nice. So you see what you can do with, with the shampoo. This is just a red shampoo, but that you have also in other colors. And this is a new hairstyle and color. Find my the way. Of in and out <laughs> of the cape. Okay, my love, you may show your hair to the world. Thank you very much. <laughs> what a welcome. Will you turn to show the hair? And please throw it over your neck. Like this? Yeah, just of course, then they can see the lines of your hair. Thank you very much and enjoy. Thank you very much. You're more than welcome. <laughs>